Hey Clara here. Um, as promised, this is a uh, look at my Roubaix um, SL4 disc 2014. Um, the only thing that is original on this is the frame forks and the uh, headset spacers. That one is new. Okay, so let's start at the front. Um, we have um, Shimano BR. R785 DI2 hydraulic levers. Um, not too bad overall. They do rattle a bit, um, and they're a bit spongy when the when the brake block gets a bit thin. Um, I'm probably looking to upgrade those to uh, um, the new 9010s, I think, but we'll see. Um, Coming around, I've got an S Works uh, 110 mil stem, and that's the control box for the uh, DI2. Um, I've got a uh, specialised body geometry power saddle. Um, it's the expert edition. It's 143 mil. Um, I've just got this recently. It's actually very comfortable. I was getting a lot of pain on my sit bones with my old with my old one. We've got an S Works carbon Zertz seat post, and um, there's the Zertz insert there. And then we've got uh, this is the uh, front derailleur. That's the uh, Di2 9000 series, I believe. We've got an S Works carbon crank 5034 um, carbon spider carbon arms, and this is a uh, Jura Ace hollow pin chain, Jura Ace 9000 series rear DI2 derailleur. It's had a little bit of battle scars when I fell off um, a few weeks back, cut my knee open and cut my hip open. Um, that is a that's the Jura Ace uh, cassette which is an 1128 um, I've recently moved to um, wax lube wax chain lube a ceramic yeah sorry um, as I was saying I've recently moved to this uh, ceramic chain wax lube um, really good. I think I've ridden that probably 10 times. Um, it's got a little bit of build up in it because I've only just um, just come back from a ride today. But I've waxed that, I've lubed it twice in about, I've probably done 200 miles I would say at the moment. And what I had to do was put my put my uh, chain and all my cassette in a um, sonic cleaner just to get them clean and I waxed them up. So um, moving on. Um, discs. Ice Tech, a Shimano Ice Tech uh, Freesia rotors, a uh, center lock, 140mm front and back. Um, that's the BR R785 hydraulic um, caliper um, with the J04C uh, pads with fins. Um, Tyres, I'm running Continental Grand Prix Four Season in 25mm width and I've actually got the rotation on the wrong way, I've just noticed. That's no good, is it? I've been riding them for ages. Seems I put put it on the wrong way around. Okay, I'll have to uh, take that off. That might be why I fell off the other week because it was on put in the wrong way. Okay, I'll sort that out and um, I'll make a video on how to change a tire. I think. Okay, um, what else have we got? Um, ah, wheels. Not the original wheels. These are. The Olio Chinese carbon wheels, direct from manufacturer. I've probably done 5,000 miles on them. 
Um, they are 38 mil depth, uh, 23 by 700 C. Um, they originally came with Novatech hubs um, in a 24 hull um, with aluminium nipples and I had uh, aero spokes on them but over here because we live on an island it's um, very salty so I was getting um, reactions in my aluminium nipples and they kept snapping and the, all the salt also ruined the hubs so I bought these um, DT Swiss 240 straight pull hubs for front and back had the, had the wheels respoked with um, brass nipples in black um, haven't had a single problem with them yet. Wheels, awesome as ever, still true. Um, really good, probably 400 odd pound delivered for carbon wheels for two. Um, right, I think that's about, ah, oh, and we got Dura race pedals as well. Um, they took a bit of a crunch when I fell off the other week. And a uh, specialized carbon bottle holder and a bell because everyone needs a bell. All right. Oh, and keep forgetting these uh, specialized carbon bars um, just for the hell of it while I was going all carbon. And uh, that's about it for my bike review. Uh, change the tire next time. Bye.